building blocks the elements are Join them together, you make a compound and you be your star The place in a table, which is called periodic So properties are predictable with their position is meteoric are the columns, some are famous and named. Alkali metals like sodium and potassium give beautiful colored flames. Soft, silvery, and reactive, so they're stored under oil. In dark bottles, so dangerous, don't touch them at all. Scientists can cut them with a very sharp. Gloss safety glasses and safety screens are still a risk to your life. Small pieces of sodium will float on water, melt into a ball and spit like a cobra. What a shock to us all. Some elements are labeled radioactive, very unstable. The nuclei break up, one gas called radon will do. It's able, it must be vented from the ground. Just to be safe, cause you wouldn't want to breathe it in. I wouldn't hang around and wait. Metals are three quarters, all the elements found. Carbon is one form, diamond is just carbon in the ground. Mercury is a liquid metal, so poisonous to life. Falls into droplets that will settle. Never open a bottle of poison or toxic matter for that matter of your life. Skull sign and cross signs are a warning of death. Harmful means don't open or play with your mess. Iodine is a solid purple halogen. It's found in group seven. When heated up, strange things happen. It sublimes. When flamed on a spatula, you'll get the shock of your life. Cause a solid turns to a purple vapor and disappears with no liquid. That's why it's strange. Iodine sublimation. The first letter of an element is a capital. If it has two, then we use lowercase. E.g. Big L is followed by little I for lithium. See if you can name the element symbols I'm gonna give you. I wonder if you know them. I wonder if you do. Try C. S. I. N. And K. G, B, and H, E. See if you know what all the elements are. In group one and group seven, can you name them now? Can you tell me four kinds of non-metals? I wonder if you can tell me just what you know about them. Just be supervised closely at all times. Keep an expert beside you. Don't mess with your time. The chemicals can be dangerous. You could get burnt or even worse. Seriously, I hope you've enjoyed this lovely song. About the periodic table, just remember it's very long to learn. Periodic table, groups are columns, rows are periods, properties in groups are predictable, alkali metals are in group 1. Halogens are in group 7. Radium decays into radon. It is a gas. Carbon can be C, 
C60, that's Buckminster Fullerene, or diamond, or graphite. Graphite conducts electricity. Iodine is a solid at room temperature. It sublimes to a vapour when heated. The answers to the questions in the song Li is lithium, C is carbon, Si silicon, N nitrogen, K potassium, Hg mercury, Mg magnesium, B is boron, He is helium. Group 1 metals lithium, sodium, potassium, rubidium, cesium, and francium. Group 7 fluorine, chlorine, bromidine, iodine, astatine. Non metals, here's an example of 4 hydrogen, fluorine, neon, and helium. Non metals are often gases at room temperature and pressure. They are usually poor conductors. Non-metals usually have low melting points and boiling points. Safety rules. Always wear safety glasses. If when your teacher uses does a demonstration they should use a safety screen. Always be supervised with chemicals. In your laboratory you should always have a laboratory technician to help a teacher to make a lab safe. X means harmful, XI in the bottle means irritant, and the skull and crossbones means poison. I hope you've enjoyed this wonderful song. But you'll need to learn the periodic table. It's very, very long. <laughs>